I'm going through a divorce, I'm floating around. You can crash in my place. Oh, you're homeless? No. You have a home? No. I can't, it's so sad. We're talking about viciously competitive people. Friction, animosity, violence. Exactly how psychotic do you think I am? So, what really happened? You gotta know. Clearly, a lot of bad blood in this community. This is Monterey. We pound people with knives <laughs> to death. And now, an HBO feature presentation. Done it again. <laughs> this is Monterey. We pound people with knives <laughs> to death. Everybody wants to prove who's the richest. And at the root of it was Madeline. You and Perry don't fight. More often we end up having sex. People say they have satisfying sex lives. <laughs> Break. Jane just didn't fit here. Thought it was nice for the nannies to get to know Jane is not a nanny. Just young. Like you used to be. I coined the term helicopter parent. But these gems, they're kamikazes. The war is on. Oh, come on. Bella, join us. Tonight, I have plans. Oh. And it's totally not your crowd. You think I have time to go to Poughkeepsie to support her, like, sick little tryst? Yeah, because nothing says, let's get this romance back on track like Poughkeepsie. Okay, I'm kind of freaking out. This is it. New York's best and brightest weeman. A whole lot of pleather, considering. Where's my name tag? Oh, no. <laughs> My wife slept with somebody else today. I caught her today. Uh, oh boy. Yeah, oh boy. Go write some jokes. I'm going through a divorce. I'm kind of floating around. You can crash in my place. Oh, you're homeless. No. Do you have a home? No. I can't. It's so sad. Look at us. Standing on the corner, eating street food. We're going to do a set tonight at a club. Following the dream. We're grinding it out. I'm happy to be with you guys. What's wrong with you? In 2017, brace yourselves for the much-awaited fourth season of HBO's smash hit comedy. Oh, I thought... He said hit comedy. I hear that now. The keywords are hit and comedy. You have made your point. You're a news show with awkward pauses. Okay. I just like my comedy to be funny, but maybe that's just me. That's a bit mean. What's it called? Lost Week Tonight with John Oliver. Is it too late to change the name? I think it probably is. Because it just seems like three random words in a row. What, Lost Week Tonight? No, with John Oliver. Oh. Change that part. Last Week Tonight with John Oliver. I think a lot of people just leave the TV on after Game of Thrones. We can just go. My God, there must be a million and a half people here. Welcome to this week's edition of He Did What? There is no Muslim <laughs> back. If there was, oh, he did fuck oh, off. God. You say, he hasn't done this, he hasn't done that, he's not going to do all these things. Hitler didn't doing... kill the Jews on the first day. He worked <laughs> up to it. This week on Real Time with Bill Maher, Milo Yiannopoulos, Leah Remini, and Larry Wilmore. And join Bill and his guests after the show, live on YouTube. Look at you all, keeping your chin up. Ah. 
It's exhausting being black. It's a lot of work, right? Every fucking day. I mean, sure, it looks fun. Especially when we're like dancing, or, like flying through the air, ducking to somebody. That shit looks amazing, right? I want to be a better black person. I don't know how to be. There are a lot of thoughts that just as a black person, like, I'm, I'm afraid to share. Like, Jay-Z means way more to me than Martin Luther King. I'm being real with you guys. It's not even close. I know every Jay-Z lyric. I only know like four bars of the I Have a Dream speech. All of my life is just me trying to overcompensate for a poor childhood. I buy a lot of shoes, a lot of sneakers. In fact, the next time you see like a young black guy in new shoes, stop and ask him, who hurt you? I'm telling you, every pair of Jordans comes with a story. Every pair. And now, an HBO feature presentation. fundraiser, victims on the back terrace. You're treating the matter as a homicide. Nobody has been ruled out. I love my grudges. I tend to them like little pets. Boundaries are gonna have to be set. Are you threatening me? We have this dirty secret. Can I ask what brought you here? Good schools. You're dead in this town. What really happened? HBO feature presentation. Oh, 
It's exhausting being black. It's a lot of work, right? Every fucking day. I mean, sure, it looks fun. Especially when we're like dancing. Or, like flying through the air, ducking to somebody. That shit looks amazing, right? I want to be a better black person. I don't know how to be. There are a lot of thoughts that just as a black person, like, I'm, I'm afraid to share. Like, Jay-Z means way more to me than Martin Luther King. <laughs> I'm being real with you guys. It's not even close. I know every Jay-Z lyric. I only know like four bars of the I Have a Dream speech. <laughs> All of my life is just me trying to overcompensate for a poor childhood. I buy a lot of shoes, a lot of sneakers. In fact, the next time you see like a young black guy in new shoes, stop and ask him, who hurt you? <laughs> I'm telling you, every pair of Jordans comes with a story. Every pair. <laughs> Somebody move in. Hi. We're your neighbors. Welcome to Cappadoo. <laughs> what are we going to do? We shut this down. It's on. Those girls were out of control. week's edition of he did what there is no muslim back <laughs> if there was oh, fuck oh. Off. you say he hasn't done this he hasn't done that he's not going to do all these things hitler he's didn't kill it. the jews on the first day he worked <laughs> up to it this week on real time with bill maher milo yiannopoulos leah remini and larry wilmore and join bill and his guests after the show live on youtube look at you all keeping your chin up really see things as they are. We see things as we are. We have this dirty secret. It's like I'm on the outside looking in. In every marriage there is pretending. Even the best ones. Nobody knows nothing about anybody. The first party was like a wedding. We were so excited. And now we're kind of back to that place of just like joy. This is the first moment where I've actually been kind of nostalgic about it. It still hasn't really hit me yet, even though they made a flower wall, that feels like a really big deal. I, I'm feeling all the feelings right now. It's really been wonderful to be in the front row of her creativity. I think this season we went pretty hard. We went really hard. There's going to be a lot of shockers. <laughs> Girls is ending. Girls is ending. What? You literally... It, I do. Oh it's my ending. god. Yeah, this is the last season. <laughs> Three. Two, one, go. I love that Lena leaves us on the cusp of what is about to happen next in our lives. We're thankful to people who loved it. We're thankful to people who didn't love yeah. it. We're thankful to the people who tweeted about it angrily. We're thankful to people who engaged in dialogue. We just can't believe we got to do this. Oh, yeah. Peter. Who is this? Oh, 
shit. Why is my hand towel on your dick? I've literally never done anything without her. I have a plan. I'll be a comedian. That's the stupidest fucking thing I've ever heard. Take these flyers, and if you get five paying customers, we'll put you on stage. Got a great live comedy show? I've been working on this corner. Walk away. God! Somebody trying to shake me from my corner. Ah! Why the fuck are you talking like you in The Wire? I haven't seen The Wire. What? There's no good way to tell people you haven't seen The Wire. I'm going through a divorce. I'm kind of floating around. You can crash in my place. There's laundry downstairs. You're going to want to do that right away. Don't sleep on that pillow. Don't put your face in this pillow. Bad shit happens in this pillow. Let's do it! Just let it go. Doing okay, actually. Somebody earned a little tootie toot. Just have a pop. Uh, yeah. Celebrate. Uh, yeah. That's enough. <laughs> you just smoke pot. <laughs> Is that a weird laugh? I, 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 I. And now, an HBO feature presentation.